As a worthy descendant of the legendary winner of the 1955 Millimilia, the SLR Sterling Moss awakens great expectations. For automobile photographer René Staud, it's a must for the next edition of his 300 SL calendar. The SLR Sterling Moss is not only shot from an enthusiast's point of view, but also from a photographer's perspective. The question is, what came first, the photographer or the automobile enthusiast? I think with me this happened at the same time. On one hand, Mercedes inspires me with its newly interpreted and improved models. On the other, there's my ambition as a photographer. The 650 horsepower Roadster is prepared with great attention to detail. One of the most important details are the fenders with their unbelievable length and precision. Not only with the new Sterling Moss, but also with the 1955 predecessor. I was fascinated when I saw it for the first time, and now I'm entranced by the legendary successor. It's a matter of elegance, length, sportiness and precision. Essentially, they're both athletes. I find light to be the most important element when we do a studio shoot. After all, a picture consists of color and light, no props, nothing in the background. From a photographer's point of view, light is an elementary and indispensable tool. The bold transition from hood to cockpit is unbelievable. This is a component I've not seen anywhere else. How the hood goes directly into the dashboard and the cockpit, that is unique. I want to create a picture which I'd like to bequeath to the following generation. And in this picture, you can not only recognize the spirit of the times, but it should also make people look back and form their own opinion. The SLR Sterling Moss challenges. A 75 model limited edition. It's already an exclusive classic with all the sophistication of a timeless super sports car.